pointing the way on how to game the system. So, James, I, I want to get to two more questions if I can before this segment's over. Uh, will this remain in Mexico policy ever take effect, albeit a, it's supposed to be a short-term deal? Uh, I, I believe when the government comes in, it would be in their best interest to do that, and I believe it would be a short-term thing because once people realize that uh, the tactic of coming in the United States and then doing catch and release doesn't work, it'll significantly reduce the likelihood of people wanting to do that. So it's almost like a virtual wall. Let's take this to D.C. Will the president shut down the government over funding for his physical border wall? I mean, is the president walking a negotiating tightrope on this one? You know, I, I just don't know the answer to that. Some of what the president's doing, I think, is kind of a deterrent value. Just saying these things, I think, hoping to scare people away from the border. So, for example, saying, I'm going to shut down the border. Well, look, the caravans can't be on a thousand miles of border and they can't be a 26 border crossing simultaneously. But we're, we, we have seen this administration shut down crossings where people have tried to cross. And I think if you see the deterrent effect, then I think it, it, it's absolutely decentivizing more people wanting to come. But would Congress let the president shut down the border? Um, I, I think the, well, it's a good question. I think the president has authority to actually shut down border crossings. I don't think that's up for question. Um, you know, the question is, is will, will there be some kind of compromise in the border wall funding? Look I, look, I think this is becoming a really insolvable problem. I mean, we are faced with two options, either control the border or have open borders. And I'm not sure, sure either political party wants, to, wants it to be sh shaped exactly that clearly, because I don't think that's a winning strategy for people just to say the option is just an open border. So you just said that Republicans and Democrats alike don't want an open border. That's what you just well, said. Well, I mean, that's, but, that's what you just he, said. Well, and that's yeah, a good yeah, thing, because no, if they can compromise well, and get said, together on this, we can help solve this right. issue. That's right, but because, because otherwise, I mean, I think that's what you're faced. You're, you're faced with, you have to be the party that's for open borders. And I'm not so sure that that's a, that's a big win. Okay. So I, I do think there could be a compromise here. Thank you.